Okay, we've come over the force between the wires and the main idea of the experiment, but there's a detail here you need to know how to measure the distance between the wires. Because you can't easily measure the distance between two things center to center when they're solid objects. And so there's a, a simple way to measure the distance by measuring the diameter of the wire and the outer spacing of the wire. So here's determining D. D is the distance center to center between the wires. Okay, you cannot measure this directly. So we'll measure D and L instead. Okay, what are those things? Well, <clears throat> here, if we zoom in on here, the wires are kind of thick. They have the same diameter. They're made of the same material. And what we want is the space between them. We want D, but you can't measure that directly. But what we can measure is, for one thing, we can measure L is the outer distance between the wires. I'll show you how to do that in the lab. Okay, L is the outer distance. So we can put a caliper on this and just clamp it on and when they touch we've got the distance out. The other thing is we can't measure the diameter or the radius of the uh, of the wires but let me call this R. The radius R is radius of the wire. We can't measure that. But D, which is 2R, is the diameter of the wire. And we can measure D because we can clamp, clamp the calipers onto the wire and measure the distance from one side to the other. So we can measure D, and we know R. We can measure L, and we want to know little d. And so you can see from this diagram that little d, the distance center to center between the wires, is big L, take away r, take away the radius here, this, this half the diameter, and then take the top part, the half the diameter, so minus 2r. But twice the radius is the diameter of the wire, capital D, so minus d. That's it. Measure these two, and we got the spacing between the wires.